Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video, I will tell you how to fix 5M ROS launcher error 147B60. If you are encountering this error, then this video provides you with step by step guide to resolve this error. So, before moving on to the video, please don't forget to hit the subscribe and like button. So, the first solution is check your internet connection. Before making any changes, make sure that your internet connection is steady and stable. Here are the steps to check your internet connection. Turn off your router or modem, wait for a few seconds and then turn it back on. If the problem persists, you can reset your network settings of your device. Go to the network settings menu, look for option to reset or restart network settings. Try connecting your device to a different Wi-Fi network or switch to a cellular mobile network to see if the issue is specific to your network connector or not. Solution 2. Temporarily disable antivirus or firewall. Turn off the antivirus or firewall to see if this fixes the problem to figure out if it is they are causing it. To temporarily disable your antivirus software, locate the, locate the antivirus program on your computer. Open its settings and disable it. To disable your firewall, follow these steps. Open the control panel, search for window defender firewall and firewall. Select the appropriate network profile, choose the option to turn off the firewall fault, save the changes and access the settings. Solution 3. Clear 5M cache. Try clearing the 5M cache as sometimes these cache can corrupt it and cause issue with the application. After clearing the cache, check if the issue is resolved or not. To clear the 5M cache on the device, follow these steps. Close the 5M cache client completely. Press the window plus key plus R. On your computer to run dialog box. Then type percentage local app data percentage. In the run dialog box, press the enter and then open the local app data folder. Locate and open the 5M folder. Inside the 5M folder, you should see the cache folder. Right click on the cache folder and select delete from the context menu. Confirm the deletion when prompted. Once cache file is once once the cache folder is deleted. You can restart the 5M client. Solution 4 Delete the Citizen FX folder. If the problem is still not fixed after clearing the cache file, try deleting the Citizen FX folder in the 5M application. To delete your cache files following these steps, close the 5M client completely, then press the window key plus R on your keyboard to run the dialog box. Type percentage local app data percentage. In the run dialog box, press the enter and this will open the local app data folder. Locate and open the 5M folder. Delete the folder name Citizen X. Solution 5 Delete Rockstar Launcher from document. For some users, deleting the folder name Rockstar in the document folder has resolved the issue. Please check if the resolves the issue for you or, or not. Here are the steps to do so. Open your file manager and navigate to document folder. Locate and delete the folder name Rockstar. After deleting the folder, launch the Rockstar application. Finally, open the 5M application to begin your multiplayer experience in GTA 5. Solution 6 Uninstall and Reinstall. If nothing has solved your problem, it's time to install the 5M from your device and then reinstalling it from the official website. I will also provide you the link of 5M.net in the description so that you can contact them and download the 5M. Here are the steps to do so. Please note these steps and follow these steps correctly to restart and uninstall the 5M application on your device. Solution 7 Contact 5M Support If none of these solutions has worked for you, then provide you with the specified, they will provide you with step by step guide to resolve the issue personalized to your experience. So that's for today guys. I hope you liked the video. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe and like button. Thank you for watching.